I just started not feeling good. And uh, you don't really realize what's wrong. And I went to my doctor, saw him and had a blood test, and it was a leukemia. I just remember being totally numb. I took on a very silent, numb kind of demeanor. I didn't know what to think. I didn't know what to do. I shut down terribly. Uh, I wouldn't open my blinds and uh, wouldn't even turn the TV on. If you maybe had known a little more or asked for more help, you know, and I didn't. I just didn't. A lot of times my patients may not have support systems around them, um, and we want them to know that really there is a support system here that you can reach out to. Um, in terms of the mind and the body connection, if your pain and your symptoms will appear a lot worse than they are if you don't have holistic care. And I think that's important for the geriatric population. If patients come to us early, the help we can provide is better. We can plug in the resources at the right time. We can alleviate the symptoms faster than later. And we can work with them on treatment plans that actually are, are reasonable for the geriatric population because what works for the young may not necessarily work for the older population in terms of medications or dosages. Don't be afraid to ask your physicians about your fears, your goals, and your anxiety that surrounds the disease process. Don't be afraid to seek out help from palliative care physicians with your goal being really a good quality of life because I think everyone deserves a good quality of life.